the action shifted to Los Angeles, the Lakers evened up the series with a blowout victory in Game 6. Wow! Setting up another epic showdown between these story rivals. The Lakers have thrown down the gauntlet with a Game 6 masterpiece. And now the stage is set for a Game 7. It all comes down to one final game. This is it. This one for all the world. We can do it. Mother! At home, Lakers Celtics. That's all y'all guys wanted to see. It's what we live for, we dream about, we love. We'll make it happen, have some fun. Game seven. What you think it is? You can either let somebody write your story or you write your own story. I ain't letting nobody write my story. Game sevens are amazing. Nine months down to three hours. It's 120 games down to four quarters. One flick of a wrist, one twist of an ankle can change everything in a heartbeat. El campeonato. Toda la temporada está en juego ahora mismo. Here we go. It's our 114th game this year. Probably had as many practices, if not more, right? You know what you have to do out there? You go out there and you beat this team to the balls. You react defensively how you have to react to each other. You operate in your offense the way you know how to do it. 20 years from now, we're going to come back and we're going to have this reunion party. And when we shake hands, let's make sure our rings touch. I think everybody right now wants to make a statement. It is an opportunity to form and submit a legacy. And this legacy is something that can happen tonight if you play well. Here comes Rondo out, letting near side. Dribbles down the paint, right to the cup, and hits the reverse layup. Nobody can stop him in the entire league in open court plays like that. Rondo straight away lobs it into Garnett. Thunderous two hand slam. It's a seven point lead. Kobe angles right, slipped on the dribble. Ryan back up and firing. No good. Artest the rebound. Lays it in. Now that was just a great muscle play by Artest. Right wing pass. Knocked away, stolen by Artest. Good defense. Good anticipation by Artest. Strong move to the best. Into the front court, down the paint, and hits the left handed layup. Lakers have come back to tie it up on a 9 0 run. And the Staples Center crowd in an early frenzy. They are fighting tooth and nail out here. It has been a scrappy first half. Everybody, I want everybody to stay aggressive. I don't want any hero basketball. Trust each other. Everybody stay aggressive, all right? Odom on Rasheed Wallace, she holding it over his head, four to shot clock, she turns, used the window and banks it home. Boy, he loves that shot. Doc Rivers could not have hoped for anything more than what he's getting tonight from Rasheed Wallace. Let's stretch this lead right here. Let's stretch this lead. Rondo in the lane, floats the shot good. Rajon Rondo gives Boston an 11 point lead. And the Celtics with the largest lead of the night. You guys are working too hard. Relax out here, play right. You gotta get better shots. You do that by making the ball move. The ball's got to move. Everyone standing here at Staples. Lakers down three with 740 left. Back out Fisher. Fisher for three. Bang! Tie game. Derek Fisher does it again in the postseason in a big moment. You can tell Bryant is sensing the finish line. It's been a 17-point turnaround here in the second half, but still plenty of time remaining. Everything we got. Let's go. Every go. loose ball. Every everything, rebound. Everything. But box out. Two. Let's go. Let's go. go. Let's go! Gasol got it to go! Play down Celtics, Lakers by six for a minute and a half to play. Brian 
with neither shoot. That's a double. Bobby Carlin, jump pass to our test. Fires a three. He got it. 20 points from on our test. Now you talk about a dagger. That's a dagger in the heart. The Lakers have won back to back NBA championships and their 16th overall. The streamers are coming down from up above. The confetti falling on the floor. Back to back titles, and they get to do it on their home floor in front of an adoring crowd. has to be one of the sweeter ones as they defeat the Celtics finally in a game seven. The 2010 Finals MVP is none other than Kobe Bryant. I had no idea how it was going to happen or how we were going to win, but I just we're going to make a new world going to win. I'm like, this is supposed to happen. Number five, man. Two for my big fella right here. Yeah. Yeah. Two day, man. 2010 NBA Finals is over. Thanks for watching Sounds of the Finals 2010.